Bro! Are you freaking kidding me? Why can't I get out? Why can't I get out of this? <laughs> hey, I'm Jay from the Cubs Scouts. Welcome to a game called Night Delivery. Now, this is one of those scary Japanese horror games that Chilla's Art has created. You are delivering packages at night to people. I don't know how sick and twisted you gotta be to take that job, but we're about to figure out how scary it is right now because it's cool that you're down with that. Everybody get ready and buckle up, because here we go! This is my last stop. After I deliver these five packages, I'm done for today. Okay, let's deliver package C. Press tab to open your inventory. You can also switch items using your mouse scroll. Let me see. I got the room 206 package. So we just gotta deliver the package. And that's pretty much it. What about this cat? Is this, is this cat gonna talk to me now? No? All right, so this is my first recording of the day. I'm pretty tired for some reason, so the commentary might be unwiped butthole. Just for a little bit. Just for a little bit though, okay? Then it's gonna be awesome. My commentary is- oh! oh my god, the freaking beam scared me. I thought that was somebody's face. I thought that was somebody's pale ass ugly face. Okay, let's ring the doorbell. Doorbell intercom. Hello, Amazon delivery! Knock on door. Come on, I got your package right here! I don't get what that means. Anybody there? Hello? Can I just leave the package here? I don't know what that means. Somebody's rustling and bustling in there? Oh shit. Okay. Um. I guess somebody's coming. Yep. Here we go. Hello, sir. Huh? Oh. You took way too long. Get the hell out of my face. Hey, what the? Hey! What was he doing in there? I don't know what my man was doing in there, but I'm getting the hell out of here. Like I said, I don't get paid enough for this bullshit. I just tried to deliver a package and the dude just threw that thing at my face. All right, cool. I hate games like this because I know something's going to happen. Like, I know that somebody is just going to try to clap these cheeks. They're probably going to be inside of this delivery truck. All right, so let's deliver package B. This one goes to room 502. Holy shit, I got to go all the way up there? Okay, so we got to go all the way to the... Whoa. I thought I saw somebody. Oh my god. Dude, get out of my face with that. Okay, let's go all the way up here. Oh, this is freaking spooky. What the hell? How the hell am I supposed to get around here? Uh. Oh. Okay, cool. So, let's go to five. Nice. Okay, for some reason, clicking on the stuff is so awkward. It's weird as shit. Oh, what if I saw somebody's face there? Holy crap. This is 502. So, let's... Doorbell intercom. Hello? Oh my god! Oh shit! My bad, your ugly ass scared me. Uh, da, da, da. Thanks. I have a reward for your great service. You love cats too, don't you? Take it and be gone. You want me to take that thing and be gone? What the? Oh, you want me to take the cat food? Thanks. I have a reward for your great service. You love cats too, don't you? Take it and be gone. Oh. Oh. Oh, you told me that through the... Okay, I'm just gonna get the hell out of here. Because this is random. I think I gotta give this little bitty itty kitty something. What is that? Oh, that's the water bottle the guy threw at me? You son of a bitch. Okay, let me get the cat food. Let me give it to the cat. Okay, cat's doing its thing. And I think... What the? Who's that? Hey! Hey, little boy! Hold up. What's that guy doing over there? I need to have a conversation with your mom, sir. Hold on. What? Oh, fuck! Oh, god damn, get the hell out of here! Oh, suck me, senpai. Dude, that is scary. Okay, get the water bottle out. The power of Christ compels you. I got holy water. There was a dog with a bowl that I think he wanted to smoke a bowl or he wanted to drink a bowl of water. So I'm gonna go get this to him because that man threw it on my face. So I might as well use it for something, right? So let me crouch down, do that. Dog is, uh, yeah, he, he's doing that. Okay. Kohei, have you got used to the new environment? You said you are doing your best to get along with everyone in the apartment. Did you get along well? I know that you are very kind. I hope other people can feel that way too. Start with one person first, and it's okay to work slowly. You tend to think pessimistically. Try to think positive. By the way, how's the dog? Aikichi, was it? Show me the dog next time, okay? Mom. Well, you're not gonna be able to see the dog, Mom, because I'm jacking that shit. After I'm done with these night delivery packages, I am yoinking that shit. I don't give a double doggy style. Damn. What the hell? 
Whoa! Dude! That bitch an Olympic sprinter! Is he running to my packages? Hey! Come on, man! I only get paid like 12 bucks an hour, dude! If you're gonna steal my shit, then you're gonna steal my shit. I can't even do anything. I'm honestly not even gonna do anything about it, to be honest. I'm just gonna get package E, and let's see where we gotta deliver this bad boy. We gotta go to room 401. Oh! Da -da -da. Huh? I'm scared! Am I the only one? Aren't you scared? This whole place, it's like I'm becoming a part of them. Never mind. Forget about it. Oh. What the? Dude looked like he ordered a microphone off Amazon and wanted to become the next big Twitch streamer or something. Oh? Me? I haven't left the room in... I don't know. I stopped counting. Oh, right. You're here for a package. Don't know if I can trust you and your parcel just yet. Talk to the priest. I can't trust you until you talk to the priest. He said he lives in apartment number 105. You can't take this parcel until I talk to the priest. If you don't take your damn package. Stupid ass freaking kid made me talk to some stupid ass freaking priest. Are you freaking kidding me? Open the freaking thing. Open the freaking thing. I'm going to knock on the door. The priest doesn't deserve my doorbell. Come on, priesty. I don't even think I spoke English on that one. Bro, looking like Gums McGee. Where your teeth at, my guy? Tsk. Huh? I see Michu sent you here. I'm the local priest. Say no more. I can sense that the package is cursed. But I need to make an offering first. Before I can perform any sanctification on the object. Monetary, that is. Tsk. What does that mean? Oh shit, I thought that was a ghost with a hand, bro. I need cash. Before I can perform any sanctification on the object. Oh, you need cash. What do you want me to do? Hold myself on the nearest street corner? Is that what you want me to do? Bro, does everybody just creepily stand in front of their door in the damn dark? Does nobody have electricity in this place? This is ridiculous. Where'd the cat go? Oh, shit. Okay, there was actually a letter here. I couldn't open the trash can before. Kohei, how are you doing? How's the new apartment? In the previous apartment, you had to move because the residents there weren't so kind to you. Is it okay this time? Before, there were people who made a fool of themselves about disabilities and welfare, right? I said it many times before, you weren't the bad one. Don't blame yourself. Also, don't be impatient about getting a job. Kohei, you're my son. You'll be okay. Things will get better. Mom. Is that how much you care about Kohei? You're just leaving letters in the trash? Belongs in the trash? Am I supposed to go somewhere specific? Because I need cash, right? All I got out of these packages. Bro, I swear, man. The dedication to my freaking craft. You spoke to the priest? directly how lucky you are i've only exchanged words through the door intercom so he needs money why of course what the priest says is always right here give this to him make sure to give it to him asap i don't want the priest to be waiting any longer okay we got some money crispy 1000 yen bills that's cute that's hot I mean, I might as well go down to, like, Tokyo or something. Have myself a fun night. Forget these stupid-ass packages. Let's go to floor number one. Whoa, what the... What the heck is wrong with this game? All right, this game is starting to piss me right off, man. This game is actually starting to annoy the hell out of me. I'm so done. I don't know why the elevator did that. I don't know why the priest still has his door wide open like some legs. But here's your freaking money, Sonny. So, uh, go get some new teeth with your freaking gummy-ass mouth. Let me double-check the amount. Wait, what? This can't possibly be enough. Does Michuru really think he can get away with this? I don't know what you want me to do. You actually want me to go hustle that guy in the hoodie some more? These people, man. Old people. See, that's why I hate old people. What? It wasn't enough? Forgive me, priest. I hope this much will help. This is all I've got for this month. I have to ask my parents to give me more. Why are you giving a random ass delivery man money if it's not even your money? I like that Chilla's art makes games that are just so random. Like the caregiver one? That one was creepy as shit. Let me double check the amount. Wait. Oh, that's enough. Barely, that is. <laughs> I'll forgive him this time. Let us begin the ritual. All this to bless a package, bro. Come on. Done. What is that? Now go away. Oh, okay. Well, can you at least give me a good rating on the um, Amazon app, please? Jesus. Man, it's a tough crowd over here in these streets. Okay, Mr. 401, I got your freaking package. Forgive me, priest. I'm ready to take the package now. No, go away. I bet he ordered something off P-Hub. That's why he needed a priest to bless the package, because that was ridiculous. Look at this big one. Package D? 
Definitely a package D, because that's a big girthy one. That's a girthy mother sucker right there. Let's see where I gotta go. I gotta go to room 305. What a time to be alive. Okay, 303, 304, 305 has gotta be right there at the end. Oh, no, it's right here. Okay, let's knock on door. Let's uh, look presentable. Don't get scared off the door opening. Please. Come on. Hurry up. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, God. If a door opens by itself, just leave it at the front door. Take a freaking picture and dip. Oh, Jesus. Okay. All right. Oh, my God. Okay, I'm leaving the package here. This is where you shit your pants. This is the part where you shit your pants. I'll be right there. Okay. Can I can I come in? I'll take off my shoes. I know it's tradition. Okay. Wow! Fuck! God damn! What is wrong with you? Huh? Harry Potter looking ass! What is wrong with her? Hey! What are you doing? What are you doing? That package. It's a bed frame. You're gonna help me build it, right? <laughs> no neck ass thinks I'm gonna put together a bed frame in the middle of night? Wow! Alright, I guess. What is wrong with you, that package? It's a bed frame. You're gonna help me build it, right? I guess. Okay. That was the most random shit in the history of everything. Okay, I was gonna use your bathroom, but I think I already shit my pants. Alright, whoa. Um, are you gonna come in here and help me? I'm not doing this shit by myself. You even have an arrow pointing to where you want the bed from? You really planned for me to come here, didn't you? Okay, set up the bed frame. What in the world? Yo, I don't play that shit. That was ridiculous. That was scary as a mother fuck. Where is she? Lady? I'm gonna take a nap. Wait. What the? What the? Oh my god. I'm not. Yo, get me out of here, bro. What is this? Oh my god. Bro, why is there blood dripping from the ceiling? Oh my god. Bro, I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. What the hell was that? What the? F Wait, can I go back? I got the chills. Yo, I got the chills! Get me out of this freaking game! I can't. I can't. I'm done. 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 I'm running. I'm running. I'm running. I'm hurting for a squirting. I'm squirting for a hurting. Package A. A. A for package A. Oh, my heart is beating so fast. All the hairs in the back of my neck are standing to attention. And why is there something right there? That wasn't there before. Room 202. Yeah, that wasn't there before. Okay. Oh, that is weird. Yeah, that wasn't there before. Room 202. So, it's right here. Okay. Let's do the doorbell. Let's do a little ding dong. A little ding dong bing bong baby. Ding dong bing bong. Oh, okay. We faded to black. I guess we're going inside. Whoa, what the? Speaking of ding dong bing bong baby. Wait, where are you going? Hey, I'm not responsible for that baby. That ain't my baby. I'm not paying child support on that thing. My baby. You have to help me catch him. What the? Are you serious? Where you at, you dumbass baby? You better be here at the park. The baby should be here at the park, right? It's a freaking baby. Come on. Is he playing? Bro, stop playing with me. Oh, what the fuck? Wait. Oh, dude. No. What is this? Oh, I do not feel comfortable being in here. What the hell? Okay. Hold on. Everybody, clench your butt cheeks. What is that? What is that? Is that a body bag? Ooh, okay. There's blood here in the corner. Dry blood. Ooh, I feel so uneasy being in here. What the hell? I think the baby's here. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, suck me, tuck me, dude. Whew. 
Whew. Oh, I am so uncomfortable. I need an adult. I mean, I am an adult. I need an adult. I need an adult that's not like me. I need an adult that's not like me. I need an adult that's built different. Oh, shit. Okay. Jay, Jay. Figure it out. Figure it out. Figure it out. Come on. Come on. You got this, bud. You got this. You got this. You got this. You're that dude. You're that dude for a reason. Okay? Hold on. Can I go in here? What the f... Oh, my good God. Dude, I keep closing doors. <laughs> I keep closing and opening doors. Oh, you guys don't even know how, like, tense my shoulders are right now. Ow! Stupid ass baby. Holding this little bitch like a football. Bro, I really just have him like he's an item. I think it's room 202, right? Oh, God. What? Do I still have the baby? Oh, my God. Whoa. Oh, shit. I don't like this. I do not like this. I was wondering why the elevator took so freaking long. Um... Okay, my packages are still here. I have more to give? Wait! That can't be! Okay, at least I get to deliver all of them. I have money, room 401, 305, 206, 502, 202. Wait, 305? I remember 305. That was the lady. Hold on, what the hell is going on here? Oh, dude. I can't go up here. So, was that baby some evil-ass baby? Probably, huh? Okay, I see a ladder right here. Can I climb up this bitch? I can climb up this bitch. This game just took a 180. It was weird. Now this shit weird, weird. Okay, I need to go to room 305. Do I have anything here? 206. 206. I can climb up here. Okay, this is like a game of that old-school Mario game. Where, like, Donkey Kong was um, at the top of, like, all these ladders. 303. Anything here? 305. Shit. I don't know how I'm gonna get over there. Oh, this is a fucky wucky, dude. Hold on. Let me, uh... Let me climb down. And then I'm gonna give package 305. Because I think I'm close by. 202. 202. Right here, right here. 202. Okay. Uh... Thanks. The baby was walking outside this morning. He is adorable. That is Mariko's child in room 202. As soon as Mariko noticed me looking at her son, she grabbed her son and took him inside the house. Please stay away from my son! Am I like a germ to her? I mean, people might say that you looking at somebody else's kid is super creepy, but can I give you this? No? Wait, can I see in here? Hey, who the hell's in here? Who gave me that shit? 401. Okay, this is 402. 401, shit. Okay, hold on. I saw a ladder that was on the other side. It was right here. So I'll go down. And then 401 is Gamer Boy. The one in the hoodie. Right? No, I just get diary entries once I deliver the packages. I thought I could get along with Mitru-san in room 401 since we were close in age. I've never seen him out of his room. I decided to visit him. He finally came out for the third time. I don't think anyone could get along with someone like you, he said. That's it. And the door closed immediately. Okay, so now we're getting a little backstory on one of the people in this game and just his experiences with the other neighbors, I guess. So let's go to room 502. What'd it do? So let's go back up here. And then I saw 502 that was up here. I think it was like right there. Okay. So we just got to knock on the door and read this. Today I gave a cat to Erica in room 502. I also have a dog, so I wish I could get along well. She told me I was disgusting, but I believed there were no bad people who love animals. I was hurt, but... But what? But what? But wait, there's more. This is 305? Okay. So let's read this letter. Arisa, in room 305, is a student. She is also a part-timer at the nearest convenience store. I can tell she is a hard worker, and I respect that. When I thought she wouldn't say hello when we passed each other for the first time this morning, she said, Are you stalking me, you ugly fuck? I wasn't stalking, damn. And the last package that we gotta give is right here, 206. At night, Mr. Takeo in room 206 was carrying a box filled with beer cans. I said, Do you mind me helping? Why the hell are you trying to help? If you have time to help, you shouldn't be on welfare. You're just a burden to society, said Mr. Takeo. What? I wonder if people around me think that way. So this is just one person's encounter with everybody inside of this place, right? 
and I need to give money. Do I give this money to the priest? Probably, right? Right here? Yeah, there you go. Okay, I was gonna say, I was like, where the hell do I give this damn money to? Okay. I guess I'm supposed to take the elevator. This morning I saw Yukichi in room 105 walking. He seems to be a priest, and I thought he was a kind person, so I went to talk. What is the weak person doing? I don't want to see it just useless without money. Never show up in front of me ever again, he said. Maybe he was in a bad mood. So that's what I had to do. I just had to deliver some money. I wish somebody would deliver me some money. I mean, I'll be down for that. Bro, come on! Open the freaking thing, you stupid-ass game. Okay, where are we going? What the heck? Bro! Are you freaking kidding me? Why can't I get out? Why can't I get out? Ah! Ah! Oh my god! Oh, here's that attention you ordered. Here. Oh my god! Oh, shit. Oh. Take your package. Take your package. Oh, God. I can't. I can't even speak the English language. What the hell was that? What the hell was that? Get me out of here. Get me out of here. I'm done. I'm done for the night. I'm done for the night. I got to do one more. What is that? Deliver this package. It had a question mark on it, too. Like, you know that's some devil shit. Like, that's some demon time shit. What is this? Room 404. Oh, great. Oh, great. Who the hell was that coming at me? They looked like they were salsa dancing toward me. Like they were lost in the sauce. They had one too many drinks. They came at me tipsy as shit. All right. Get in the elevator. I think I want to get in the elevator. <laughs> Maybe not after what just happened. That was crazy. Like, you know when the video games have those uh, video game barriers that I always mention throughout the history of this channel? Oh, my God. Freaking trash scared me. Belongs in the trash. Yeah, that's what was going on there. It wouldn't let me out of the elevator, and I was like, uh-oh. Something's about to happen. Something's about to go down in this game. And then there you go. That's exactly what happened. So room 404. And let's figure out what we're getting into over here. That took a lot out of me. I think that took a soul out of me. Okay. I mean, you clearly have a package here. What do I, uh... What the heck? Oh, there's a fridge here. It looks like those pictures that I saw where there was like a bunch of fridges. What the heck? Okay. This is random. Is somebody gonna pop out? Like that lady who kind of popped out when she was like, I'll be there in just a second. Just give me a minute and I'll be there. Oh shit. Is it gonna be like one of those things? What's this? That is, um, something I don't understand. Welfare document. All right. Okay. Welfare document, you say. That doesn't make any sense. Let's check in here. Okay. Run-of-the-mill bathtub. Run-of-the-mill shitter. There's packages in here, like a mother sucker. What does it all mean, though? I wish I could read what that says. I don't know. It might be important. But I have no clue what that means. Okay. Jay, figure it out. What's in here? Can I just leave the package and go? Please. Alright, I'm leaving. I can't leave. Oh, shit. Okay, this game won't let me leave. So that means there's something in here that I need to find. It's not that. It says welfare document. But I don't know what that means. Oh, shoot! What the hell? Bro, this dude was just getting a head start in life. He was just getting himself headstrong. Oh, my God. What the? Bro, are these all the people that I delivered packages to? Oh, shit. Bro, literally got backstabbed. Oh, my good God. Look like blood was being dragged in here. Is somebody going to kill me next? Bro, I'm next. Oh, God. Okay, sorry. Sorry, everybody. Let me calm down. Let me calm down. I know everybody wants me to progress through this because this might be scary to some people to...
play on their own, so they look towards me. But you know my anxiety is always through the roof when I play these games, and I think I'm the landlord? Okay, I'm the landlord now. Interesting. So I'm the person who controls all the tenants in this building. So we gotta figure out what happened to all of them because they apparently all got stabbed. So this is my home. Welcome to my crib. Complimentary horror game flashlight. Got some nice delicious chippoos. And uh, that's a bunch of stuff that I clearly don't know. And uh, huh. All right. All right, Detective Jay's in the building, everybody. No idea what the hell I'm doing. But, uh, let's go. Where do I go? Do I just go to the places where I delivered packages to? Is that what you want me to do? Okay, I think that's what I do, everybody. Let me see. I remember one of the rooms was 202. So let's check it out. 202. There you go. 202. 202. Nope. Okay, I guess we're not going to 202. That door's slightly ajar. Right? It is. Oh my god! Who the hell was that? What the? Ugh! Oh, they gave me the chills! Bro, I didn't even know somebody was looking! Oh, shit. Oh my god, that was creepy. Wait. Did they open it again? What the? Oh, they didn't. Oh, that gave me the chills, though. Guys, I got goosebumps all over me body. I got the goosey loosies all over me body. Holy shit. Okay. Jay, figure this out. Figure this out. Come on. Why is it getting so damn dark? Oh, shit. What is this? Oh, 404. Oh, dude, I don't like this. The welfare document's still here. This is where everybody died, huh? Oh, shoot. Ah! What the heck? <laughs> oh, what is up with this game? What is going on with this? Whose stinky ass foot is that? If you don't get your athlete's foot out of my freaking haunted apartment. Oh, now you're going to bring in two athletes' feet, right? Athletes' feet, not athletes' foots, right? Yeah. If you don't get your stinky at what? You going to show me some bulge or lack thereof? Wait. It looked like a dude was walking with a fridge on his back. I'm so confused. Chilla's art really think that they could just get away with this, huh? Just get away with doing whatever they want and then me being like, Whoa, that's crazy, bro. Wait, I got ending two. How do I... How did I get ending two? I really gotta play the whole game again just to see what other ending I can get. Like, come on, man. There's no way. There's no way I'm doing all this again. Okay, so if I go in that room, then I'm pretty much effed in my A. I looked at the welfare document again. So yeah, if I go in there, then I'm effed in my A. So don't go in there. Don't go in there. Don't go in there. Yeah, don't go in there. Don't go in there. What do I do, though? <laughs> if I don't go in there, what the hell do I do, though? Okay, I played through the whole game again. I have no idea where I'm supposed to go. I don't know if there's an option for me to just get the fuck out of here or what, but I can't leave. Let me see. Is there something that I can click on here? Please. Come on, man. Give me a gun or something. Something to protect myself, please. All right, let me see. Oh, see? As soon as I go in there, I die. Yeah, guys, I replayed through the whole game again. I got the same exact ending. I don't know how to get any other endings in this game, but I tried. Like, you can't say that I didn't try because I tried to. I went through the whole game a second time. It took me almost half an hour to get through this. And I just got that same stinky feet ending of this dude who has like a fridge on his back. But hopefully you all enjoyed this playthrough of Night Delivery. If you enjoyed it and want to see more of this type of content in the future, make sure you guys give this video one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude!